Good evening. Good evening. It's good to see you all here this evening. Welcome to Zion Lutheran Preschool Spring Program. Uh, tonight, our preschool students will share the life of Jesus. Uh, but before they begin, let's begin with a word of prayer. So let's hold our hands, bow our heads, close our eyes. Let us pray. Lord God, Heavenly Father, we thank you for this day. We thank you for gathering us together this evening as we hear your children tell the life of your Son, our Savior, Jesus. We ask that you continue to be with them as they finish up this school year and continue to bless them with your presence. We're thankful for all the gifts you give us in this life, but most especially your Son, our Savior, in whose name we pray. The children hear many Bible stories. We would like to share with you tonight songs that help to tell the story of Jesus' life on earth. On the night that Jesus was born, an angel appeared to the shepherds. Good job. Who were watching their sheep nearby. The angels told the shepherds that they would find the baby wrapped in swaddling claws and lying in a manger. What is a manger? An animal feed box. Very good. Suddenly there were many angels that appeared, praising God and singing, Glory to God in the highest. And on earth peace to those on whom his favor rests. When the angels had gone back into heaven, the shepherds said to one another, Let's go to Bethlehem and see this thing that has happened, which the Lord has told us about. They hurried off and found Mary and Joseph and the baby who was lying in the manger. When they saw him, they told others what the angels had told them, and all who heard were amazed. It's 
is a story to teach you a lesson. That's right. Jesus told stories that people could understand and relate to. One of the stories he told was about a wise man and a foolish man. Jesus told the people, those who listened to his words, learned from them, and followed his teachings, would be like the wise man who built his house on a rock. Those who heard his word but did not learn from them or follow his teachings would be like the foolish man who built his house upon the sand. Thank you. 
after he rose on Easter Sunday. He then ascended, which means that he went up. up. Where did he go up to? Heaven. heaven. He went up into heaven. Even though Jesus returned to heaven, he has promised his disciples that he would always be their friend and would always be with them. Jesus makes that same promise to us.